Hello my friends, welcome to my channel, Bringer of Light Intuitive. I'm Cindy, thank you so much for being here. This is a series that I am doing now. It has its own playlist. Who am I reading for? That's what it's called. I just love to deliver these messages and I love to know who I am reading for. So feel free to take this if it resonates for you. These are timeless. Also check out the playlist and see if anything else is for you there. They are timeless no matter when you're seeing it. The only thing I ask is that you just comment below and let me know who you are, who I'm reading for if you want to. All right, so let's just go ahead and dive in. I'm hearing that there's some sort of surprise coming in. So I'm hearing this and I don't know if that's what is coming through, but let's go ahead and see. I feel like there's some sort of surprise for somebody here. And uh, let's see if we can find out what that is. I want to get nosy. All right. What is this? What does my friend need to, need to know who's watching? All right. I've got the Eight of Pentacles here. The Eight of Pentacles says that you've been working hard on something. Maybe you are about to get ready to have a surprise promotion. Maybe you're about to have a surprise expansion in your business. I do feel, I do feel finances. Interesting. These are always about love and I'm trying to get away from that sometimes. <laughs> I'm hearing a surprise, so I feel like you, you've you been working really hard on something, and if you've been feeling held back, if you've been feeling stuck, if you've been feeling like you're not being noticed, or you've been being passed up for promotion, or anything like that, this could very well be a surprise that is coming in very soon for you within the next eight days, maybe even two weeks, two, sorry, well, two weeks because it came out, I'm feeling between eight days and eight weeks, there's some sort of surprise that's going to come in for you on so about something that you've been working very hard. You've been working very hard on. You've been really increasing your skills. You've been focused. You've been maybe even taking some sort of class classes to increase a skill. You've been showing up every day. You're giving it your A game. Whatever this means for you, it can talk about finances, it can talk about something else. Whatever it is that you have been focusing on and you've been waiting patiently for some sort of expansion, for something to take off, to get noticed, to uh, be promoted or a new job to come in, something like that. So I'm feeling that pretty strong. So let's see what happens next. I've got the Knight of Swords on the bottom of the deck. Now he talks about a message coming in. There's also the Wheel of Fortune. Things are about to change. You're about to get a surprise. And the Knight of Swords, he comes in unexpectedly. And the Wheel of Fortune is sudden change. So you just keep doing what you're doing because there is something that is getting ready to change for you. And even though I feel like you've been working towards this, it's like you don't see it coming when it actually happens. I have the Four of Pentacles and I've got the Four of Swords. You know, two fours, when they come out together in a reading, says you're on the right track. So you may be stressing about this. You may be thinking, gosh, is this ever going to happen for me? Is, is anything ever going to go right in this situation? I'm feeling like you, you just need to know that it's coming. You need to know that you are doing everything right. You're making the right choices. You're doing the right thing and you are going to be noticed. I feel like you had to learn some sort of lesson in this and that's why you had to wait. But it's like spirit is actually in control of the situation and spirit is actually bringing you in some sort of a surprise that you know, but you don't know like when, okay? But two fours in a reading says relax. Don't worry. Everything is exactly the way it's supposed to be. You're coming into your increase. You're coming into what it is that you've been working towards. You just don't know the when yet. But know that it is right around the corner. I have two fours here. That's another eight. Did you know that 2024 is an eight year in the numerology? world and eight is that of abundance dreams manifesting things manifesting okay so now i've got two eights here 
And that tells me that this is right on track for whatever it is that you've been working so hard for. 2024 is your year. And it's going to start out in the first part of 2024. <clears throat> whatever it is that... I've got another 8 here. You've got to be kidding me. Look up 888 and I'll bet you, I'll bet you too. When you see this reading, you're going to start seeing 888 everywhere. 88 or 888 is going to start showing up for you everywhere. You're going to see it on license plates. <laughs> you're going to see it in random places on receipts in <clears throat> random places. I don't know what's going on with my voice right now. But this could be com communication coming in for you <clears throat> that has been sort of held back. Look what came out. The Wheel of Fortune. Things are about to change. Things are definitely about to change. You've been triggered because I feel like you have been passed up for promotion. You've been maybe feeling like the universe has been passing you up because you've been showing up every day. And you've been doing the work and you've been you've been working on yourself. You've been working on whatever it is that you do because it has to do, I feel like, with money, <clears throat> maybe at your own business. But it's been putting you in your head and triggering you into thinking that success was not for you or you will always be passed up or something just doesn't quite ever work for you. So I feel like it's been putting you in your head. I've got in the heart of the spread, I've got the three of swords. It's like frustration and hurt, anger, just feeling like life isn't fair. And right next to that, I've got the moon. The moon is dark energy as well. The moon is like anxiety and fear and I can't see my way forward. Why isn't something breaking for me? You're overdue for a breakthrough. That is what I'm going to title this message. You are overdue for a breakthrough. But you need to know that everything that you've been through, this path that you've been walking on for however long it's been, could just be this year because this has been a challenging year for a lot of people. It could go back farther, even two years, even eight years. You could be on this path for a long time, broken, fearful, anxious, wondering when is my day ever going to come. The thing about the moon card is, on traditional tarot, the moon, there's this, the moon is right here on the card, and behind the moon is the sun. The sun is your breakthrough. The sun is the light shining after the rain you know the sun is the happiest card of the deck the moon is you've you've had to walk this path to learn whatever you've learned along the way and yes it feels hard and it feels challenging and it doesn't feel fair but the harder your journey the harder the challenges the mo the things that you've been learning and the harder this journey's been for you the bigger the reward is on the other side, okay? Your reward is coming. Your reward is coming. Don't you give up, all right? Don't you give up. You have let go of things that don't serve you. You have learned so much on this journey that you've been on. You have healed through stuff. You've been learning lessons. You've been letting go of all the things that were not healthy for you or that didn't serve you properly. And you deserve so much more. And you're, you're finally walking into what is for you. You know, you've, you've had to let go of things that you were emotionally invested in. Maybe you have suffered loss and you didn't understand what in the heck is going on here. Why does life feel so dark and scary and uncertain? You're going in. This is the eight of cups. You're going to the nine of cups. You're going in search of your wish fulfillment. All right. So maybe you consciously know this, maybe you don't. You've been on a path that was sort of destined for you to learn what you've learned, to get to where you are now, and suddenly, okay, suddenly, fortune is changing. 
You've got the Wheel of Fortune here. This is sudden, unexpected change, positive change, fortune changing. This is fortune after difficulty. This is the happy ending. This is you receiving finally. This is you receiving your success, your fortune, your promotion, your new love. This is the happy ending. This is contentment. This is peace. This is your family being happy. This is fortune going in your favor. This is like magic. It's going to happen magically. This is suddenly, suddenly everything shifts for you. Suddenly you come together with your person. Suddenly you get this job. Suddenly you're being noticed for the work that you've been working so hard for. Suddenly things change. Your suddenly is coming. And your suddenly is going to be beyond. This is beyond. This is beyond. Your suddenly is magical. It's going to feel magical. It's unexpected. It's your breakthrough that you're overdue for. And it's leading you to your wish fulfillment your happiness, your your fulfillment, and your contentment, and your bliss. This is you just in your new cycle. The 10 is in your new cycle of happiness, of joy, and feeling like, wow, everything is finally falling into place for me. I've got this 10 and this 10. This is your new cycle, okay? And two 10s together in a reading could mean a change of career. Maybe you're changing careers and it's going to be magical. Okay, so if you've been thinking about changing careers, let that be a confirmation for you that something is going to be presented to you. It's going to come into your awareness somehow, either by spirit or by somebody bringing it to you, or maybe you've been applying or maybe you've been thinking about this and suddenly you get the green light. This is suddenly, okay, suddenly, <laughs> but you are attracting it. You are in your power. You are in this energy of the queen of wands, which she is attractive. You are attracting exactly what it is that you've been working so hard for. You're attracting in promotion. You're attracting in getting noticed, people wanting to work with you, people wanting to give you their money. People wanting to be with you. If you're single, you're attracting in love. The love. You're attracting, you're magnetic right now. And you had to go through all the darkness in order to become this magnetic person that you are now. So know that it wasn't for nothing. Everything that you've been through is going to serve this purpose. You're going to look back and you're going to realize it all was serving this purpose of where you're going right now. Everything is going to make sense. Everything is going to feel so much better. Know that you are on the right track. You're doing the right thing. You're making the right decisions. You've done the right work. Everything is right. And you're going to, you're going to see what it is that is coming in very soon. You're gonna see what it is that you've been working towards. It's bigger and it's better than you think. You may think you know what you're working towards, but what's actually going to happen is bigger and better than you think. Okay, so get ready to really enjoy your life. Get ready to be successful. Get ready to love your life. Get ready to be chosen. Get ready to be promoted. Get ready to be recognized for all this work that you've been working so hard at. You are being noticed. The right eyes are always on you. Opportunities are always handed to you. Everything always works out for you. Use that as your new affirmations going into this new year and watch what happens because life is about to change for you. Life is about to change for you. I love you. I am here to help. If you wanna book a private reading with me, that information is down below. I just wanna know who I'm reading for, so let me know, and where do you fall on this 
timeline, okay? Is this past energy for you and you're already on your way? Things have already started changing for you or you've got some sort of big change here that has already happened? Or is this, or are you still in this moon energy of uncertainty and what the heck, you know? Let me know where you fall and let me know how this resonates and know that big changes are coming. Your life is about to get so, so good. <laughs>